Good morning. Um, it's August 2022. Um, I've been meaning to jump on here all month uh, just to say what's going on. Um, if you haven't seen yet, my new Infinite Night Helix pattern will be released on August 23rd. And um, we will be starting a close along with that pattern on September 13th. So it'll give you three weeks to get your pattern. And so um, I don't have a photo of the quilt because the original quilt I made for my nephew as his graduation um, present last month. So it has been gifted and it's gone. But I am working on a baby size right now in these colors. It's almost done. I'm putting the blocks together right now. And I thought I should jump on really quick before I have to start making breakfast and everything for the kids. Um, if you have any questions about the quilt along, you can always message me or um, join over in the quilt along group, which is Happy Cloud Creation Quilt Alongs. And I put a link in the description of this video so you could join. Also, if you just go to my page and go to groups, it's the one that says quilt along group. Um, I don't know if I can see comments or not. Um, if there's any comments, I'll get back to you after because I don't think I can see them. Anyways, okay, so I have a poll over in my Quilt Along group right now for if you want a digital download copy or if you want a printed paper copy of the pattern. I know with my Joyful Meadows Quilt Along, um, I sold out too soon because I did not order enough. So my plan is to take the number um, that is over in that poll and like add 10, 15 patterns to that so that I don't run out right away. Um, Cause the very first two days of the pattern release, August 23rd and 24th, the pattern will be on a steep discount of 25% off. And then after that, it will go to 15% off. And then um, once the quilt along starts, it'll go down to 10% off. So um, if you're wanting to grab a pattern, the first two days are the best days to grab it. And I just wanna make sure I have enough paper patterns for everyone that wants one. Um, this is a more intermediate, intermediate quilt pattern just because it has so many pieces. Um, the whole pattern is like 20, 21 pages long, which is the longest pattern I've ever done. Um, and I actually, the font I usually use is a size 12 and I bumped it down to a size 11 just so that it would be a little less amount of pages. Um, but it's still viewable. You can still read it um, very clearly. Um, sorry, I say I'm um, way too much. I'm just, I should have wrote this down. I was just like, oh man, I should jump on really quick. Um, the quilt along, I think it ends November... 8th is the last week and, week, and that's the week that we'll be putting our quilt top together. You can find the schedule over in the Quilt Along group. If you don't want to be part of the group, that's fine too. I will put up a blog post on my um, website, happycloudcreations.com, on August 23rd when the pattern is released. I plan on um, putting it on for sale at 7 a.m. on Tuesday, the 23rd, and I will send out a newsletter as well to everyone that's on my list i'm um, saying hey it's ready for purchase and um i've already sent out the schedule in the newsletter but i'll also put it in that blog post so you can refer to it later and during the quilt along each week i will jump on live video in my facebook quilt along group um to go over that week's step so the first week we'll be cutting all our fabrics cutting all of our pieces um and then the following ones i will give you tips in, um for putting those pieces together um, so it does, it has a lot of same pieces that I've used in my previous quilts, but since it has just has so many different pieces and blocks and a lot to, to, um, manage, that's why I consider it more of an intermediate than a beginner friendly. Um, if you are a beginner and you've done a few of my patterns before, um, you could try it. I don't want to discourage you, but it, it is a lot to keep organized. Um, the baby size does not have any flying geese because it does not have the two side columns. It just has the center column. 
So um, if you're someone that doesn't like flying geese, you may want to try the baby size. Um, originally, I wasn't going to have the two side columns, but then I thought that's a lot of dead space and some people don't like that. So I put the side two columns. So um, you could just do that center uh, twist and do bigger panels on the side if you're somebody that um, likes a lot of dead space. Um, I know uh, my tester, Cindy, she likes to make a smaller size and add borders to make it larger to fit her bed. So I think she made like a full size and she's making it big enough to fit a queen or a king because she's adding extra borders to it. So, um, because my king is a little big, it's 105 by 110, which I'm gonna try to make it for the quilt along this time. Um, oh, I do see comments, okay. Good morning, Susan. Um, how many pages to download? So the pages, I think it's 21 pages to download. Let me, it's right here on my other browser. I don't know if you guys can still see me. Yes, it's 21 pages total to download. Three of those pages are um, coloring sheets um, because the baby and then the, the middle sizes, throw, twin, full, and queen, um, are all the same layout. And then the king is basically the same layout. It just has bigger sashing strips in the middle to make it more of a square. So it's 105 by 110. So if you don't want a king that's that big, because I think some people prefer like 100 by 100, you can make the full size, make your sashing, make um, extra sashing strips in the center and give yourself bigger borders around the edges. Um, so if you have any questions, you can put them down on this video, or you can email me at happycloudcreations at gmail.com. And I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. So I'm ordering the paper patterns next Monday, and then the pattern will be released the following Tuesday. So excited to see everybody's fabric um, selections. Um, my testers have been posting their progress photos over in the Quilt Along group, and it's so cool to see the pattern in different color combos. So I'm going to, I still haven't purchased my fabric. Um, I'm gonna, for my king size, I'm gonna do a black background with a white and red twist and then yellow stars, which is actually on um, the alternative color combos on the pattern. Um, I put the fabric requirements already in the Quilt Along group. It's under the files, and then it's, might also be under the featured as well, um, but I'm really excited. So that's about it for today. Um, that's all that's going on this month. Finishing this, hopefully I can get the blocks together today. Um, I don't know if I'll actually be able to finish the whole top. I got a lot to do today. So I might um, be finishing the top over the weekend or Monday, and then I'll show you a picture of the baby size top. Um, I hope you guys have a great weekend. Um, and great day. I guess it's only Thursday, right? Um, my husband always gets Fridays off, so I feel like today is my Friday. <laughs> so have a great day, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.